yeah hello dear students so we enter into the section c in section c we have 10 questions from 28 question to 37 questions you have to write any five questions each carries seven marks so let us have a discussion the first question if f equal to 1 comma 2 2 comma minus 3 3 comma minus 1 then find 2f 2 plus f f square and root f <coughs> this type of questions is very very important we need to practice this type of questions simple questions easy to get seven marks in functions so first given f of x we have to write it given f equal to 1 comma 2 Two comma minus three, three comma minus one. In this first question, they are asking two f. That means here one comma two means one is in domain, two is in co-domain. So to get two f. For co-domain values, you have to multiplying by two, so that is the meaning of two f. So one comma two into two, two comma two into minus three, three comma two into minus one. So which is equal to one comma four, two comma minus six. Three comma minus two. That's all. That is the value of two f. They are asking next question is two plus f. So two plus f meaning is for the co-domain elements you have to add two. So two plus f is equal to. So one comma two plus already two is there. Next two comma two minus three. Three comma two minus one, which is equal to one comma four. Two comma minus one. Three comma one. Next f square they are asking third question f square. F square means for co-domain element you have to square it. So one comma two is there, so we can write as one comma two square. Next two comma minus three whole square. Next three comma minus one whole square, which is equal to one comma four, two comma nine, three comma one. Next after f square root f root f the last one A root f means for co-domain elements you have to take root so one comma root two next two comma root minus three three comma root minus one so in this a root of negative values cannot be exist now so what will be exist only one comma root two is only possible. Root minus three, root minus one cannot be exist. So that is the reason we cannot write it. Root minus three, root minus one not possible. So this is the answer. We'll move on to the next question number twenty nine. In question number twenty nine, three a equal to one minus two one zero one minus one three minus one one. Then find a cube minus three a square minus a minus three i. Where i is a unit matrix of order three, so i three one zero 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 one zero 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 one. So a value is given means we need to calculate a square and a cube. After that, take LHS and get RHS value. Find value means consider that uh, a cube minus three a square minus a minus three a getting the answer. So first uh, given a is equal to One 
वन माइनस टू वन जीरो वन माइनस वन थ्री माइनस वन वन नेक्स्ट यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट ए स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर मीन्स वॉट ए इंटू ए सो विच इज ईक्वल टू ए स्क्वायर आई एम राइटिंग हि वन माइनस टू वन जीरो वन माइनस वन थ्री माइनस वन वन इंटू वन माइनस टू वन जीरो वन माइनस वन थ्री माइनस वन वन सो एक्चुअल मल्टीप्लिकेशन फर्स्ट रो फर्स्ट कॉलम वन इंटू वन माइनस टू इंटू जीरो वन इंटू थ्री नेक्स्ट वन इंटू माइनस टू फर्स्ट रो सेकेंड कॉलम माइनस टू इंटू वन वन इंटू माइनस वन वन इंटू वन वन इंटू माइनस सॉरी माइनस टू इंटू माइनस वन वन इंटू वन नेक्स्ट सेकेंड रो फर्स्ट कॉलम जीरो जीरो माइनस थ्री जीरो इंटू माइनस टू वन इंटू वन माइनस वन इंटू माइनस वन नेक्स्ट जीरो इंटू वन वन इंटू माइनस वन माइनस वन इंटू वन थ्री इंटू वन माइनस वन इंटू जीरो वन इंटू थ्री नेक्स्ट थ्री इंटू माइनस टू थर्ड रो सेकेंड कॉलम थ्री इंटू माइनस टू माइनस सिक्स माइनस वन इंटू वन माइनस वन वन इंटू माइनस वन माइनस वन नेक्स्ट थ्री इंटू वन थ्री इंटू वन नेक्स्ट माइनस वन इंटू माइनस वन प्लस वन वन इंटू वन सो विच इज ईक्वल टू वन प्लस थ्री फोर माइनस टू माइनस टू माइनस वन माइनस फाइव फोर माइनस थ्री टू माइनस टू नेक्स्ट सिक्स माइनस एट फाइव दिस इज अबाउट ए स्क्वायर नेक्स्ट ए क्यूब कैन कैलकुलेट सो ए क्यूब इज ईक्वल टू ए स्क्वायर इंटू ए ए स्क्वायर वैल्यू वी गॉट इट नो दिस वन फोर माइनस फाइव फोर माइनस थ्री टू माइनस टू सिक्स माइनस एट फाइव इंटू वन माइनस टू वन जीरो वन माइनस वन थ्री माइनस वन वन विच इज ईक्वल टू नाव ऐक्चुअल मल्टिप्लिकेशन डायरेक्टली फोर प्लस जीरो प्लस ट्वेलव सो फोर प्लस जीरो प्लस ट्वेलव नेक्स्ट फोर इंटू माइनस टू माइनस एट माइनस फाइव माइनस फोर फोर इंटू वन माइनस इंटू माइनस प्लस फाइव प्लस फोर माइनस थ्री इंटू वन माइनस थ्री जीरो माइनस सिक्स माइनस थ्री इंटू माइनस टू सिक्स टू इंटू वन माइनस टू इंटू माइनस प्लस टू सो नेक्स्ट माइनस थ्री इंटू वन टू इंटू माइनस वन माइनस टू इंटू वन नेक्स्ट सिक्स इंटू वन माइनस एट इंटू जीरो फिफ्टीन नेक्स्ट सिक्स इंटू माइनस टू माइनस ट्वेल्व माइनस एट इंटू वन फाइव इंटू माइनस फाइव सिक्स इंटू वन माइनस एट इंटू माइनस वन प्लस एट प्लस फाइव 
so a cube value a cube equal to 12 plus 4 16 minus 5 minus 4 minus 9 minus 8 minus 17 uh, 8 plus 5 13 here minus 9 10 next minus 7 21 minus 25 19 so a square we got it and a cube also we got it now a cube minus 3a square minus a minus 3i that value now consider a cube minus 3a square minus a 3a square minus a minus 3i minus 3i so a cube means this matrix 16 minus 17 13 minus 9 10 minus 7 21 minus 25 19 minus 3 into a square value a square value we got it now here 4 minus 5 4 minus 3 2 minus 2 6 minus 8 5 minus a minus a value 1 minus 2 1 0 1 minus 1 3 minus 1 1 minus 3 i 3 into i i means 1 0 0 0 1 0 0 0 1 so 16 minus 17 13 minus 9 10 minus 7 21 minus 25 19 minus each and every term of this bracket value that means matrix multiplying by 3 so 12 minus 15 12 minus 9 6 minus 6 18 minus 24 15 next minus 1 minus 2 1 0 1 minus 1 3 minus 1 1 minus 3 0 0 0 3 0 0 0 3 so which is equal to So, corresponding elements you have to subtract and add 16 minus 12 minus 1 minus 3. Next, minus 17 plus 15 plus 2 plus 0. Next, 13 minus 12 minus 1 minus 0. Next, minus 9 plus 9 minus 0 minus 0 next 10 minus 6 minus 1 minus 3 next minus 7 plus 6 plus 1 minus 0 next 21 minus 18 minus 3 minus 0 next minus 25 plus 24 plus 1 minus 0 next 19 minus 15 minus 1 minus 3 so which is equal to 16 minus 16 0 17 minus 17 13 minus 13 9 minus 9 0 
all are zeros 10 minus 10 7 minus 7 21 minus 21 25 minus 24 here 19 minus 19 so all are zero so zero matter zero matrix therefore we conclude that a cube minus 3a square minus a minus 3i is equal to 0. We will move on to the next question dear students. Yeah, the next question number 30. Solve the following system of equations by Cromer's rule. In this Cromer's rule, first you have to write the given system of equations and write the values of a, x and d. So, given system of equations, x plus y plus z is equal to 1. 2x plus 2y plus 3z is equal to 6 and x plus 4y plus 9z is equal to 3. The above system of equations, the above system of linear equations or system of equations simply. can be written as a x is equal to d where a is equal to coefficient matrix their x y z coefficients we are writing as a matrix so in the first equation x coefficient y coefficient z coefficient in second equation 2 2 3 in third equation 1 4 9 capital x is equal to solution matrix that is x y z and constant matrix capital d is equal to 1 6 3 first whether solution in exist or not by finding the determinant of a that means debt a calculate dear students debt a is equal to so determinant of this matrix 1 1 1 2 2 3 1 4 9 so which is equal to 1 into 18 minus 12 minus 1 into 18 minus 3 plus 1 into 8 minus 2 so which is equal to 18 minus 12 is 6 into 1 18 minus 3 15 minus minus 15 8 minus 2 6 plus 6 12 minus 15 minus 3 so therefore debt a is equal to minus 3 should not be equal to 0 means solution will be exist. So, after that debt a value we got it. Debt a we can denote it by delta that is equal to minus 3. Keep in mind dear students. Next calculate in the Cromer's rule they are asking here Cromer's rule. So, in the Cromer's rule x, y, z how to it will come delta 1, delta 2, delta 3 calculate. So, delta 1 is equal to determinant of the first column was replaced by constant matrix 163. The first column replaced with 163. The remaining second column, third column as it is 124, 139, which is equal to 1 into 18 minus 12 minus 1 into 96, 54 minus 9 plus 1 into 
24 minus 6 18 minus 2 is 6 into 1 54 minus 9 43 no not 43 45 that to minus 45 24 minus 6 so 18 plus 18 so 18 plus 6 24 24 minus uh, 45 minus 21 so delta 1 is equal to minus 21 next delta 2 you can calculate delta 2 is equal to first column as it is 1 to 1 second column was replaced with constant matrix d 163 third column as it is 139 now find out determinant 1 into 54 minus 9 minus 1 into 18 minus 3 plus 1 into 6 minus 6 54 minus 9 so 54 minus 9 45 that took plus 45 18 minus 3 15 15 to minus 1 minus 15 6 minus 6 0 so 45 minus 15 is 30 so therefore delta 2 is equal to 30 next delta 3 calculate delta 3 that means third column was replaced with constant matrix first column is 1 to 1 second column is uh, 1 to 4 third column is 1 6 3 which is constant matrix now calculate 1 into 6 minus 24 minus 1 into 6 minus 6 plus 1 into 8 minus 2 So, which is equal to minus 18 minus 0 plus 6, which is equal to minus 12. Therefore, delta 3 is equal to minus 12. After getting the values of delta 1, delta 2, delta 3, so solution matrix we need to calculate now. So, therefore, x is equal to delta 1 by delta that is equal to delta 1 value 21 minus minus 21 divided by minus 3 that is equal to 7 y is equal to delta 2 by delta delta 2 value is 30 30 by minus 3 so minus 10 so z is equal to delta 3 by delta so minus 12 divided by minus 3 which is equal to 4 therefore the solution of uh, the solution of given system of equations by Kramer's rule is capital D is equal to sorry capital X is equal to X Y Z that is equal to 7 minus 10 4 so whether it is satisfying or not in first equation x plus y plus z is equal to 1 if you substitute just this is a verification not compulsory dear students just verification whether our answer is correct or not in the first equation x plus y plus z is equal to 1 is there so x value 7 y value minus 10 uh, z value plus 4 so 11 minus 10 which is equal to 1 so first equation we got it now x plus y plus z is equal to 1 it satisfies means this is the right answer therefore this is the solution no need to do that verification till here only enough i hope you understand your students we will move on to the next question number 31 
in question number 31 the question is related to matrix inversion method in matrix inversion method the first the given system of equations write in the form of ax equal to d x is equal to a inverse d given system of equations Two x minus y plus three z is equal to nine. X plus y plus z is equal to six, and x minus y plus z is equal to two. The above system of equations. can be written as a x is equal to d from that x is equal to a inverse d where x is inverse sorry solution matrix a inverse is the inverse of the matrix to exist inverse here uh, what are the a what is b what is d what is x here where capital a is equal to coefficient matrix 2 minus 1 3 1 1 1 1 minus 1 1 capital x is equal to x y z and d is equal to 962 9 6 2 so in the in the matrix inversion method to exist the inverse we need to calculate the determinant of a so that a first you can calculate 2 into directly I am writing 2 into 1 minus of minus 1 already minus 1 is there now so minus of minus 1 plus 1 1 minus 1 plus 3 into minus 1 minus 1 2 into 2 4 0 minus 2 into 3 minus 6 which is equal to minus 2 therefore debt a is equal to minus 2 should not be equal to 0 that implies a inverse exists after that inverse of the matrix you can calculate inverse of a matrix inverse of a matrix means for every element cofactors we need to calculate so a inverse formula is what 1 by data into adjoint a so adjoint of a before going to calculate adjoint of a cofactors of a we can calculate cofactors of a so like uh, see here cofactors of a so first plus cofactor of element 2 we are writing 1 1 minus 1 1 minus mod cofactor of minus 1 cofactor of minus 1 1 1 1 1 next cofactor of 3 plus 1 1 1 minus 1 next cofactor of 1 minus mod cofactor of 1 minus 1 3 minus 1 1 plus for cofactor of 1 2 3 1 1 minus cofactor of So, 
so cofactor of 1 here in the second row third column element you can eliminate 2 minus 1 1 minus 1 next cofactor of 1 cofactor of 1 here plus so minus 1 3 1 1 here minus cofactor of minus 1 so 2 3 1 1 plus cofactor of 1 2 minus 1 1 1 So, for this uh, values we need to calculate. One minus of minus one, one plus one, two, two into plus one, so two, zero. Minus one, minus one, minus two. Minus one plus three, so minus one plus three means two, two into minus, minus two. 2 minus 3 minus 1 next minus 2 plus 1 minus 1 minus into minus plus once again 2 into minus 1 minus 2 plus 1 minus 2 plus 1 is minus 1 minus 1 into minus plus 1 minus 1 minus 3 minus 4 2 minus 3 minus 1 minus of minus 1 plus 1 2 minus of minus 1 2 plus 1 3 after getting cofactors matrix adjoint a is equal to adjoint a adjoint a is equal to transpose of cofactors matrix so cofactor matrix is 2 3 4 minus 2 minus 1 1 minus 4 1 3 so which is equal to adjoint a so 2 minus 2 minus 4 first column will become first row 0 minus 1 1 minus 2 1 3 after getting adjoint a a inverse is equal to adjoint a by det a which is equal to 1 by det a value is how much det a is equal to minus 2 we got it here so minus 2 into adjoint a 2 minus 2 minus 4 0 minus 1 1 minus 2 1 3 after getting a inverse they are asking x value x means solution of the matrix x is equal to a inverse of d that is equal to a inverse means one minus one by two, two minus two minus four. 0 minus 1 1 minus 2 1 3 into d value constant matrix what is d here 9 6 2 9 6 2 9 6 2 or 3 rows are there one column is there here 3 by 3 so the number of columns in the first matrix should be equal to number of column rows in the second matrix is then only multiplication is possible so 3 by 1 is the required matrix so minus 1 by 2 into so actual multiplication first row first row, one no, first column so like this only so 3 by 1 will come so that means uh, 3 rows one column so 2 into 9 18 minus 2 into 6 minus 12 minus 4 into 2 minus 8 0 into 9 minus 1 into 6 plus 1 into 2 minus 2 into 9 18 minus 
वन इंटू सिक्स थ्री इंटू सिक्स थ्री इंटू टू सो विच इज ईक्वल टू माइनस वन बै टू माइनस ट्वेंटी एटीन सो माइनस टू माइनस फोर माइनस एटीन प्लस ट्वेल्व माइनस सिक्स सो ईच एंड एवरी टर्म डिवाइडिंग बै माइनस टू माइनस टू बै माइनस टू माइनस फोर बै माइनस टू माइनस सिक्स बै माइनस टू विच इज ईक्वल टू वन टू थ्री देर फोर द सोल्यूशन मैट्रिक्स द सोल्यूशन आफ गिवेन सिस्टम आफ इक्वे गिवेन सिस्टम आफ equations by matrix inversion method is capital x is equal to x y z that is equal to 1 2 3 so just verification not compulsory to do that Any one of the equation we can take it. X, Y, Z values one, two, three. No, any one of the equation we can take it. So, for example, third equation X minus Y plus Z. X minus Y plus Z. That value substitute. X value one, Y value minus two here. Y value two and Z value three. So four minus two is two. So this equation is equal to two or not? So x minus y plus z is equal to two. Equation is correct. So our answer is right. This is the required solution, dear students. We'll move on to the next question. Yeah, the next question: Find the vector equation of the plane passing through the points four i minus three j minus k, three i. Plus seven j minus ten k and two i plus five j minus seven k, and show that the point i plus two j minus three k lies on the plane. So here, this question we can split into two types, two parts. One is finding a vector equation of plane passing through three points, and second one is after getting the equation of plane, the point substitute in that and it satisfies the point lies on the plane so here observe carefully dear students first the vectors given vectors we can write it let the vectors be o a bar that is equal to small a bar first vector you write it that is 4i minus 3j minus k o b equal to small b bar which is equal to 3i Plus seven j minus ten k. O c is equal to small c bar that is equal to two i plus five j minus seven k. And the third, no, sorry, fourth vector O d that is equal to small d bar is equal to i plus two j minus three k. But the vector equation of passing through first three points only, no. So we know that the vector equation of plane, the vector equation of plane passing through the points, passing through the points. Whose position vectors? Whose position vectors means P V. Whose position vectors are O A, O B, O C? Is R bar equal to? One minus s minus t into a bar. A bar means what? Plus 
S B bar S B bar plus a T C bar where T comma S belongs to real number in this play in place of A bar B bar C bar that position vector substitute and write it so for that uh, three marks will come so that is the respective value substitute r bar equal to 1 minus s minus t into a bar value 4i minus 3j minus k plus s into b bar 3i plus 7j minus 10k plus t into c bar 2i plus 5j minus 7k so vector equation of plane passing through three points is over next what is our duty they are asking to prove the point i plus 2j minus 3k lies on this plane so that means these position vectors a bar b bar c bar and the point d i plus 2j minus 3k which are lying on the same plane only no that means if you prove that these four points are coplanar then the points lying on the same that given points are the same plane that means the fourth point is also lying on that so to prove the points are coplanar so OA, OB, OC and OD. Or position vectors of A bar, B bar, C bar and D bar. O A, O B, O C, O D are position vectors of A bar, B bar, C bar, D bar. So to prove the points are uh, the points are lying on the same, consider what for we are considering to prove the points are on the same plane. Consider box of A B, A C, A D. The meaning of A B A C A D is A B bar how to calculate O B minus O A. A B is equal to O B minus O A. So directly O B minus O A directly can subtract. 3 I minus 4 I is minus I. Next uh, 7 I minus of minus 10 I will come. 10j sorry next minus 10k plus k so plus 9k so this is about ab next similarly ac ac means oc minus oa so oc vector 2i minus 4i is 2i 5j minus of minus 3 so plus 8j minus 7k plus k so minus 6k next ad od minus oa od minus oa means od minus i minus 4i minus 3i two j minus five j minus three j minus 3k plus 7k so plus 4k so these three vectors we need to prove coplanar so box of ab ac ad is equal to determinant of 
their coefficients of a b a c a d minus 1 10 9 2 8 minus 6 minus 3 minus 3 4 i j k so box if you prove this determinant value 0 0 into anything is 0 the coplanar will come that means the fourth point d also lying on that so minus 1 into 32 minus 18 minus 10 into 8 minus 18 plus 9 into minus 6 plus 24 32 minus 18 so here 14 minus 14 will come 8 minus 18 is minus 10 minus into minus plus 10 100 24 minus 6 is 18 18 into 9 that also plus will come now yeah but I am getting called here students one minute Yeah, we will come to this uh, next to plus 9 into minus 6 plus 24. 24 minus 6 is uh, 18, 18, 9 is uh, 162, 7s, 162. So, here also. OC minus OA, once I will check that, OC minus OA, uh, 2i minus 4i is minus 2i now here, this, that's why, so it will change it, automatically it will change, here minus 14, this will be ok, and here it will be 140 will come here, uh, because the minus 10 into minus 8, minus 8, minus 18, So, plus 18 will come now that time, minus 8, so here also AD bar also once again I have to check it is AD bar OD minus OA, I minus, uh, I minus 4 means minus 3i, 2j minus of minus plus 5i. So, here only it is mistakes plus 5i it is 5j, 5j plus 5 will come. Next OD minus y is minus 3k plus k minus 2k will come. So, based on this, uh, it will change. So, minus 1 into minus uh, here it will be change automatically, it will change minus 16 minus 18 minus 10 into uh, 4. minus 18 next 9 into minus 10 will come so 9 into minus 10 plus 24 so minus 14 this will be ok 4 minus 18 is minus 14 into minus 10 plus 140 uh, next year 24 minus 10 is 14 14 into 9 so plus 24 once again 9 into here also minus 9 I'm very sorry so here OB minus OA means minus 10 K plus K means minus 9 
so very careful dear students while writing it's very important so minus 9 into the 14 so 126 will come so minus 126 minus 14 minus 140 minus 140 plus 140 means 0 only no into i bar so 0 into that any vector i j k for all it will be continue for that so a b a c a d equal to 0 that implies a b c d or coplanar coplanar means so the points are lying on the same plane therefore the o d equal to d bar point lies on the plane this is the conclusion only d students you remember first by using first three points find equation of plane for the three marks after that by using that four points so first three points and last point o a o b o c o d find position vectors of a b a c a d a b means o b minus y a a c means o c minus y a a d means o d minus y a after getting up this word consider this like this and prove the points are coplanar if the points are coplanar means the points are the same line same plane so that's why they are asking to prove that the same plane no? so hence proved now next question if a equal to 7i minus 2j plus 3k b value and c also given compute a bar cross b bar and a bar cross c bar and a bar cross b bar plus c bar they are asking So, after that verify whether the cross product is distributive over vector addition or not. That we will verify by finding the values. So, first what we have to do? first write it given vectors and find out a bar cross b bar a bar cross c bar given vectors first step a bar equal to 7i minus 2j plus 3k b bar equal to 2i plus 8k and c bar equal to i plus j plus k the first one is a bar cross b bar the first one a bar cross b bar we know that cross product how to do first row i bar j bar k bar a bar vectors 7 minus 2 3 b bar vector 2 j is not there means 0 k is not is there 8 so how to expand 3 by 3 like this only you can do that i bar into minus 16 minus 0 minus j bar into 56 minus 6 plus k bar into 0 minus of minus 4 plus 4 which is equal to minus 16 i minus 50 j plus 4 k this is about a bar cross b bar next a bar cross c bar you can calculate a bar cross c bar 
सो आई जे के ये बार मीन्स सेवन माइनस टू थ्री सी सी वैल्यू वन 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 विच इज इक्वल टू आई इन टू माइनस टू माइनस थ्री माइनस जे इन टू सेवन माइनस थ्री प्लस के बार इन टू सेवन माइनस ऑफ माइनस टू प्लस टू सो माइनस फाइव आई सेवन माइनस थ्री फोर फोर इंटू माइनस माइनस फोर जे प्लस नाइन के ए बार प्लस बी बार ऑल्सो ओवर नेक्स्ट बी बार प्लस सी बार यू कैन कैलकुलेट नेक्स्ट बी बार प्लस सी बार सो द सम ऑफ द वेक्टर्स बी बार इज टू आई प्लस जीरो इंटू जे प्लस एट इंटू के प्लस सी बार वेक्टर आई प्लस जे प्लस के सो करस्पांडिंग एलिमेंट्स सॉरी करस्पांडिंग आई बार जे बार के बार सेंस यू कैन ऐड टू आई प्लस आई इज थ्री थ्री आई जीरो जे प्लस जे इज जे एट के प्लस के नाइन के दिस इज अबाउट बी बार प्लस सी बार नेक्स्ट ए बार क्रॉस बी बार प्लस सी बार सो द नेक्स्ट वन ए बार क्रॉस बी बार प्लस सी बार इक्वल टू आई जे के ए बार सो ए मीन्स सेवन माइनस टू थ्री सेवन माइनस टू थ्री बी बार प्लस सी बार मीन्स थ्री वन नाइन विच इज इक्वल टू आई इन टू माइनस एटीन माइनस थ्री माइनस जे बार इंटू नाइन सेवन जो सिक्सटी थ्री माइनस नाइन प्लस के बार इंटू सेवन माइनस ऑफ माइनस सिक्स प्लस सिक्स माइनस ट्वेंटी वन इंटू आई सिक्सटी थ्री माइनस नाइन हाउ मच फोर सो फिफ्टी फोर सो माइनस फिफ्टी फोर जे प्लस थर्टीन के कीप दट इक्वेशन नंबर वन सो दिस इज अबाउट ए बार क्रॉस बी बार प्लस सी बार सो द आर आस्किंग टू फाइंड द रिजल्ट वेदर वेरीफाई वेदर द क्रॉस प्रोडक्ट इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव ओवर वेक्टर एडिशन और नॉट सो नाउ ए बार क्रॉस बी बार वी कैलकुलेटेड बी ए बार क्रॉस सी बार ऑल्सो वी कैलकुलेटेड आफ्टर दैट वी वी हैव टू डू द सम ए बार क्रॉस बी बार प्लस ए बार क्रॉस सी बार द सम ऑफ दीज टू वेक्टर्स इज इक्वल टू इक्वेशन वन देन इट इज वेक्टर द क्रॉस प्रोडक्ट इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूटिव ओवर वेक्टर एडिशन ए बार क्रॉस बी बार वैल्यू इज वॉट माइनस सिक्सटीन आई माइनस फिफ्टी जे माइनस सिक्सटीन आई माइनस फिफ्टी जे प्लस फोर के प्लस ए बार क्रॉस सी बार ए बार क्रॉस सी बार इज माइनस फाइव आई माइनस फोर जे प्लस नाइन के सो माइनस सिक्सटीन आई माइनस फाइव आई माइनस ट्वेंटी वन आई माइनस फिफ्टी माइनस फोर माइनस फिफ्टी फोर जे प्लस फोर प्लस प्लस थर्टीन के सो फ्रॉम वन एंड टू फ्रॉम वन एंड टू वी गेट ए बार क्रॉस B bar plus C bar is equal to A bar cross B bar plus A bar cross C bar. We conclude that the the cross product is distributive over vector addition. The cross product is you have to mention here. the cross product is the cross product is distributive 
distributive over vector addition we will move to the next question dear students the next question if box of b bar c bar d bar plus box of c bar a bar d bar plus box of a bar b bar d bar equal to box of a bar b bar c bar we have to prove so for this uh, here then show that the points uh, with position vectors a bar b bar c bar d bar are coplanar so let o be the origin why because the position vector we can relate with the origin let o be the origin let capital a capital b capital c capital d be the given points be the given points whenever points are there for all the points a b c d related to the o position vectors we can form it that is the reason we are assuming that let o a is equal to small a bar o b is equal to small b bar o c is equal to small c bar and o d is equal to small d bar yeah, i hope you understand next a b b c when the four points are collinear coplanar we conclude that a b a c a d box of a b a c a d in the previous problem also we discussed consider ab is equal to ob minus oa that is equal to b bar minus a bar similarly ac oc minus oa that is equal to c bar minus a bar next ad od minus oa equal to d minus a since the points <coughs> sorry here important point uh, you remember dear students if the points capital a capital b capital c capital d are coplanar then box of ab bar ac bar ad bar is equal to zero so very 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 important point so box of abc if and only if when the points are coplanar here they mention that they are coplanar no a b c d r coplanar if and only if box of a b a c a d is equal to 0 so box of a b c a b means we already wrote b bar minus a bar comma we no no need to write comma just vectors ac ac means uh, c bar minus a bar ad means d bar minus a bar is equal to 0 so box of abc can be written as your important point box of a bar b bar c bar can be written as 
a bar dot b bar cross c bar we can write like this way so this is also we can write it as b bar minus a bar dot cross product of c bar minus a bar cross d bar minus a bar is equal to 0 now b bar minus a bar dot cross multiplication that means uh, actual multiplication c bar cross d bar next minus c bar cross a bar minus a bar cross d bar minus into minus plus a bar cross a bar in cross product when two vectors are same their value goes to be zero you remember students in cross product a bar cross a bar or b bar cross b bar so in the next step this value goes to be zero next uh, b bar minus a bar dot c bar cross d bar minus a bar cross d bar next minus c bar cross a bar that value is 0 in the next step each and every time you have to multiply so b bar cross b bar dot c bar cross d bar next b bar with this one so minus is there now so minus b bar dot a bar cross d bar next minus b bar cross c bar b bar dot c bar cross a bar along with this minus a bar also each and every minus a bar dot c bar cross d bar next minus into minus plus a bar dot a bar cross d bar next one more minus into minus is plus a bar dot c bar cross a bar is equal to 0 so once again just i will show dear students in what way i am writing these two next these two next these two like this i multiplied after that these two after that these two after that these two i hope you understand now so one dot one cross can be written as box only no so box of b bar c bar d bar minus box of b bar a bar d bar minus box of b bar c bar a bar minus box of a bar c bar d bar plus box of a bar a bar d bar plus box of a bar c bar a bar equal to 0 in the box two vectors are same the box value goes to be 0 so whatever I kept here flower bracket these values goes to be 0 so the remaining terms uh, box of b bar c bar d bar minus box of b bar a bar d bar minus box of b bar c bar a bar next minus box of a bar c bar d bar is equal to 0 so in the answer we need to give in rhs a bar b bar c bar no so the first term they are asking to prove first box b c d only b c d it is there b bar c bar d bar next in the second box c a d is there but uh, uh, you have to arrange in the order 
BAD. So I want uh, ABD. So if you interchange these two, this minus value will become plus. So plus A bar, B bar, D bar. Next here also. First these two interchange here plus will come. After that these two will be interchange. Again plus will come. So first plus B bar, A bar, C bar. A, C, D. So I want C, A, D. If you interchange these two plus will come now. Plus C, A, D equal to 0. In the next step, box of B, C, D. Next plus box of A, B, D. Next, if you interchange these two minus will come. Minus box of A bar, B bar, C bar plus no change at all. Here C, A, D only it will be. Box of C bar, A bar, D bar. So this minus value we can take this side. Box of B, C, D plus box of A, B, D plus box of C, A, D is equal to box of A, B, C. Hence proved, hence the result. I hope you understand dear students, based on this uh, definition of Copeland R, we have to prove in this way. We will move on to the next one. Yeah, the next question number 35. If A, B, C are angles in the triangle, then prove that. So, in the first step, what we have to write it, dear, dear students. Given that, A, B, C are angles angles of a triangle means angles in a triangle is good angles in a triangle then a plus b plus c is equal to 180 or pi so leave some space we will consider lhs what is LHS? Sin A plus sin B minus sin C. So, for first two terms, sin C plus sin D formula you can apply. So, here I am writing sin C plus sin D formula. sin c plus sin d 2 sin c plus d by 2 cos c minus d by 2 so the first term will becomes 2 sin a plus b by 2 cos a minus b by 2 minus sin c can be written as in half angles we will write it formula 2 sin c by 2 cos c by 2 2 sin c by 2 cos c by 2 Again, a plus b plus c is equal to 180, a plus b by 2 means a plus b by 2 is equal to 180 minus c by 2. So, 90 minus c by 2 only, you know. So, sin of a plus b by 2 is sin of 90 minus cos theta by 2. 
साइन ऑफ ए प्लस बी बाई टू इज इक्वल टू साइन ऑफ नाइन्टी माइनस सीटा बाई टू इज कॉस सी बाई टू डायरेक्ट आई एम राइटिंग हिया साइन ऑफ नाइन्टी माइनस सी बाई टू कॉस सी बाई टू ना वन बोर्ड सी रिमेम्बर सो टू इंटू साइन ऑफ ए प्लस बी बाई टू अदरवाइज ए प्लस बी बाई टू नाइन्टी माइनस सी बाई टू कैंड साइन ऑफ नाइन्टी माइनस कॉस कॉस सी बाई टू इंटू कॉस ऑफ ए बाई टू माइनस बी बाई टू ए माइनस बी बाई टू मीन दैट ओनली माइनस टू साइन सी बाई टू कॉस सी बाई टू सो टेक कॉमन टू कॉस सी बाई टू फ्रॉम बोथ द टर्म्स कॉस ऑफ ए बाई टू माइनस बी बाई टू माइनस साइन सी बाई टू दट इज ईक्वल टू टू कॉस सी बाई टू कॉस ऑफ ए बाई टू माइनस बी बाई टू माइनस सी बाई टू साइन सी बाई टू इज ईक्वल टू कॉस ऑफ ए प्लस बी बाई टू साइन सी बाई टू इज ईक्वल टू टेक कॉस ऑन बोथ साइड्स सो कॉस ऑफ ए प्लस बी बाई टू मीन्स ए बाई टू प्लस बी बाई टू म इन ट्रिग्नोमेट्री ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन इन ईच एंड एवरी स्टेप फार्मूला इज टू बी अप्लाई so please thorough dear students each and every formula 2 cos c by 2 into here cos of a minus b minus cos of a plus b 2 cos a cos b formula so 2 cos cos of a minus b minus cos of a plus b they are asking to prove the result 2 sin a sin b will come even that also I'll write it cos of a minus b minus cos of a plus b is equal to 2 sin a sin b so here in place of a b a by 2 b by 2 is there 2 sin a by 2 into sin b by 2 so 2 to the 4 first sin a by 2 Next b sine b by two into cos c by two, which is required R H S. I hope you understand, students. They are asking to prove that result only, no? Now we will move to the question number thirty-six. The next question, question number thirty-six. If cot A by two, cot B by two, cot C by two is equal to three is to five is to seven. So first, given cot A by two is to cot B by two is to cot C by two. Is equal to three is to five is to seven. The formulas for cot a by two, cot b by two, cot c by two. You need to learn, dear students. Cot a by two means s into s minus a divided by delta is to s into s minus b divided by delta is to s into s minus c divided by delta. That is equal to three is to five is to seven. So, in LHS, S by delta, S by delta, S by delta, you can cancel it. So, after cancelling that same values, it will becomes S minus A is to S minus B is to S minus C is equal to three is to five is to seven. 
So a is to b is to c is equal to c is to d is to d wing n is to m is to n means a by l equal to b by m equal to c by n. So that is s minus a by 3 is equal to s minus b by 5 is equal to s minus c by 7. This is equal to some constant k we are assuming that same means we are assuming. So equating these two equating these two equating these two. So s minus a is equal to 3k s minus b is equal to 5k s minus c is equal to 7k so add all values s value make as a subject so s minus a plus s minus b plus s minus c is equal to 3k plus 5k plus 7k s plus s plus s 3s minus of a plus b plus c is equal to 15k that implies 3s minus 2s is equal to 15k so s is equal to 15k s value we got it after s value they are asking to show the values of a is to b is to c is 6 is to 5 is to 4 so s value we got it now Therefore, S minus A is equal to 3K. S value is what? 15K minus A is equal to 3K. So, 3K we can take this side. 15 minus 3, 12. 12K is equal to A. Next, S minus B is equal to 5K. 15K minus B is equal to 5K. 15k minus 5k is 10k. 10k is equal to b. Next, s minus c is equal to 7k. 15k minus c is equal to 7k. 15 minus 7, 8. 8k is equal to c. So, therefore, they are asking to show the answer a is to b is to c. No? a is to b is to c is equal to a value 12k is to b value 10k is to c value 8k. So, in all the terms k will be common and cancel like as by delta 12 is to 10 is to 8. So, all are 2 multiples 2 6 are 2 5 are 2 4 are. Therefore, a is to b is to c is equal to 6 is to 5 is to 4. Hence proved or hence the result. I hope you understand your students. Once again just I scroll on. Only based on the formula cot a by 2 formula s into s minus a by delta cot b by 2 formula s into s minus b by delta cot c by 2 via formula s into s minus c by delta. In all the three terms, S by delta common and cancel here and uh, taking that ratio, we will get it. The next question and last question in this session. So, very important question. We will expect in the public examination also this type of question. Whenever A, B, C is provided in the question, First, we need to calculate S, S value. So, from that easily, we can calculate the other values. So, first information you write it given that A is equal to 13, B is equal to 14 and C is equal to 15. So, next, we have formula. S is equal to A plus B plus C by 2. So, S is equal to 13 plus 14 plus 15 by 2. S is equal to 
13 plus 14 27 27 plus 15 42 42 by 2 21 so s is equal to 21 s value we got it after getting the value of s s minus a s minus b s minus c calculate now s minus a so s value 21 minus a value 13 that is equal to 8 so therefore s minus a is equal to 8 next s minus b is equal to 21 minus 14 which is equal to 7 s minus b is equal to 7 next s minus c is equal to 21 minus 15 equal to 6 so s minus c is equal to 6 whenever we know the value of s s minus a s minus b s minus c you can calculate the value of delta therefore delta is equal to under root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c s value is root over 21 into s minus a is 8 s minus b is 7 s minus c is 6 21 can be written as 7 times of 3 8 can be written as 2 into 2 into 2 6 can be written as 2 into 3 so here already one of the 7 is there one more 7 is there I forgot to write so 7 into 7 7 square 3 into 3 3 square 2 into 2 into 2 into 4 square is it 2 power 4 16 no 16 can be written as 4 square so ultimately delta equal to square root of 7 into 3 into 4 whole square square root cancel 21 into 4 84 so delta value 84 after getting the delta value first they are asking to prove capital R is equal to we know that formula we know that or we have delta is equal to a b c by 4 r that is one of the important formulas but from this capital r i want na capital r is equal to a b c by 4 delta so a value is 13 b value is 14 c value is 15 by 4 times of delta 84 14 ones are 14 6 are 3 twos are 3 fives are 13 fives are 65 divided by 4 twos are 8 therefore capital R is equal to 65 divided by 8 so it is there in this the first question answer is over next question small r is equal to 4 they are asking delta is equal to sr from that r make as a subject small r is equal to delta by s delta is equal to 84 by s value is 21 that is equal to 4 therefore small r value is equal to 4 21 4 zone. next r1 R1 is equal to formula delta by S minus A. It implies R1 is equal to delta value 84. S minus A value, we got it now S minus A. 8. S minus A value is 8. So, 4 table, 4 21s by 4 twos. Therefore, R1 is equal to 21 by 2 next r2 is equal to delta by s minus b that implies r2 equal to delta value 84 by s minus b value s minus b value 7
so 7 12s are 84 so 12 therefore r2 is equal to 12 next r3 is equal to delta by s minus c that implies r3 is equal to delta value 84 by s minus c value s minus c is equal to 6 so 14 6 84 so therefore r3 is equal to 14 so whatever they are asking we already completed all the values i hope you understand that distance once again just i'll show uh, scroll down all the answers Thank you dear students. Wish you all the best. Wish you best of luck. All the best from our channel Maths with Panindra. Thank you signing off Maths with Panindra.